Hello everybody, thanks for tuning in to the video today, I really appreciate it. So today, I'm going to talk about my favorite animated film ever, which is Your Name. By the way, warning, this video will contain spoilers for this movie. So there you go. Your Name is a Japanese animated film made by Makoto Shinkai, who made other films like Children Who Chase Lost Voices, Weathering With You, and recently Suzumi, I did a movie review on that, no spoilers, in my channel quite some time back, you can go check that out. If you want and I've yet to see his other films but I will watch them soon and this movie came out in 2016 this is a fantasy movie set in the real world if you compare if you have been to Japan I think you can see some of the areas there like real places in this movie animated with uh, and it also has a romance storyline intertwined with it as well as some Japanese cultural thing like uh, musubi and things like that so I watched this film a few years back and oh my god, what an experience it was. I was clearly not ready for it. Like This coming from someone who usually doesn't cry when watching videos and I cried like two or three times when watching this movie. It is just that emotional. This is also my favorite rom-com film ever. Well, it starts off as a rom-com and then it slowly becomes into a full-blown emotional film. So here's the basic plot. First, we have Taki and Mitsuha, they are swapping places and then after some time the body swapping the body swapping stops. So Taki, who's a teenage boy from the city, goes to find Mitsuha, who's a teenage girl from Itamori town. And then when he realizes that Mitsuha has lost her life due to the comment that the film has been hinting on from the very beginning, I was just thrown for a roller coaster emotional ride man. It was just I was not expecting that at all. And this film transitioned from a rom-com to a more gripping emotional story at that moment. This is a gorgeously animated film with some of the, some very tearful moments. Like that scene where Taki goes and sees Mitsuha's memories is the most gorgeously animated scene in any animation ever. And you cannot disagree with that. It is definitely number one. And then we also get to a full, we also get a full circle moment. That scene in the beginning where Mitsuha gives Taki her wristband, but that was like three years ago before Taki knew her. And then twilight moment when they can finally see each other, which was talked about during the class that uh, Mitsuha was in in the uh, earlier part of the movie. And that part where Mitsuha just opens her hand and sees Instead of seeing Taki's name, she sees uh, I love you and oh my goodness, I just cried during that scene. I couldn't control myself, like it's just that emotional. It literally completely emotionally shattered me. I will never get over that scene. And like that was literally the last straw for me. And then we have, um, okay there are some people saying that uh, Taki should have just written his name down. I disagree with that viewpoint for two main reasons. Uh, first, because it would not have the emotional power that uh, I, the I love you would have. And second, it will not be able to motivate Mitsuha to move forward. Like, at that moment, she was already down on the ground. She's been hurt a lot. And she needs motivation to get up and move forward, right? And that I love you was her motivation to move forward. Truly a magical experience this movie was. Then we get to see Mitsuha and Staki keep on after the comment after people from Itsumori town got saved by the comment we see them a few years later and then um, both Mitsuha and Taki are keep on missing each other from seeing each other and I was really strongly anticipating them to f see each other at least once so you can you can feel how I feel like I was raging inside like are they gonna meet or not like it's just and then um, after that they go on to ask after that they meet each other at the staircase which by the way, it's a real place in Japan. Um, they see each other, ask each other's name, and that was just the perfect ending to the movie. Like, a perfect ending. This movie, gorgeous animation, great music by... Great music, phenomenal story, and it just sucks how this movie and A Silent Voice as well lost the Oscar nomination to movies like The Boss Baby and Ferdinand. Like, don't get me wrong, those two are great, but compared to A Silent Voice and Your Name, it was nowhere as good. Like, in fact, I was hoping for Your Name to win the Oscar that year. 
and Japan has its share. Another interesting fact is that um, Japan has its fair share of experiencing disasters. Shinkai himself has said that in one of his interviews, the 2011 Tohaku earthquake that ravaged Japan was one of his inspirations for this movie. So it'll probably hit home for many Japanese viewers. And another thing that I'm very well aware of is that um, they are making a Hollywood live action remake of this movie. I think J.J. Abrams is somehow involved. And I also heard that this will be a Western perspective. I don't know what to say for that. Usually, usually not all the time, but usually Hollywood live action remake for anime doesn't really work. But um, not sure. Not sure how true the Western perspective, not sure how true that they're making a live action remake for this movie is gonna be. I'm not sure how true that news is, but if they are, I don't know what to expect. I need to see more news of it first to be able to say anything. And anyways, I think I'll wait for more information on that. And also, this film was also, another thing that made this film so great was the Japanese culture weaved into it, like, that made it so interesting as well. And and removing that because you know you're putting a western perspective inside so if you're going to remove that you make the film less interesting the story of the film less emotionally gripping so i don't know how that's going to work but i'm just going to wait for more information on it so yeah that's all i have for today let me know what you thought in the comments below if you like this video click the like button if you want to see more subscribe to my channel and see you next time and by the way this might probably be my last video before i'm gonna have a before there's going to be a long time that i don't make a video i'm very sorry i'm very busy during this weekend but next weekend i will i'll try to make more videos and so thanks for your patience please stay patient thank you so much you guys are the best and see you next time and if you want to see any other videos let me know in the comments below